For practice at exercise 1.12 fight song, we are asked to write a complete Java program in a class named fight song that generates the following three figures of output. We need, we need to use static methods to show structure and eliminate redundancy. In particular, make sure main contains no system.out.println statements and that any system.out.println statements repeated are captured in a method that is just called once. All right. And the same system.out.println statement never appears in two places of code. So we can only write system.out.println for one, um, one time, every single time. So um, we can look at these in chunks like this. We have four parts. We have one, two, and then this part, and then this part, which is four. First things first though, we actually need to write our class. So it's going to be public class fight song. We are going to have our starting brace and a closing brace. We are going to have our main method, which will run all of our methods. It's going to be public, static, void, main, and then string args. Just like that. Next, we can start writing our methods. So we have go team go, you can do it. That's going to be the first method. So we can just call it first like this. Now, if we go below our main method, we can actually write this method. It's going to be public static void first and we can close that and start writing. So we're just going to have a system dot out dot print ln statement. And we can actually put all of this in one print line, making sure we have our quotation marks. We can print this like this, but do a slash n to get a new line between those two. Now that we have this, we can see that it's going to run it for first. Go team go, you can do it. Now we need a space. So we can actually just do, well, it's asking us not to have any system.println statements in our main method. So we can have a space method like this and write it below here as public static void space. And what this is just going to do is have a print statement system dot out dot print ln that will just leave a space in the middle so we have a space here and now we're going to have go team go you're the best in the west go team go you can do it so we need to make that method and it's going to be called we'll call it second public static void second and in our public static void second, we notice that it repeats go team go, you can do it. So instead of rewriting that, what we can do is call our first method like this. And then we can write a sysout statement in here, system.out.println like this. And in here, we will write you're the best in the West, just like this. And we can write it again on the same line by doing slash n like this. And then it repeats go team go, you can do it. So instead of typing that out, we can just call the first method again. And this is the same thing for this part right here. So what we can do is output our second method and this takes care of all of this so far. We need another space, and then we are going to need our second method again, another space, and then lastly, our first method one more time. And if we run that, it should work. <laughs> 